Good afternoon. Someone once wrote, there's three B's, the rules, three B's to good speech making. Be direct, be brief, and be seated. I intend to follow that uh, rule. Um, I thought I'd use today to kind of introduce myself and also to talk a little bit about my priorities. My name is Jason Yergel, and I am running for Washington County Commissioner District 2. I have lived and worked in Washington County for 20 years now. Um, I am a licensed legal investigator. In the course of my work, I have uh, visited and interfaced with every law enforcement agency in Washington County, with the county government, every department within the county, every city government in Washington County, most of the hospitals and many of the schools. Uh, I, uh, I'm politically active in my committee. I'm a member of the Washington County Democratic Party and I hold several positions there. I'm on the First Congressional District Committee, as well as the DPO State Platform and Resolutions Committee. On there, I chair, this year I'm chairing the uh, Public Safety, Civil Rights, and Governmental Reform Plank. I'm artistically active in my community. Uh, I have performed, I occasionally do a little bit of acting, uh, community, community acting, nothing to brag about. Uh, I've appeared in productions at Hart Theater in Hillsborough and also at the Beaverton Civic Theater. I volunteer in my community, I've delivered Meals on Wheels, and I've been a big brother for many years. Um, here in uh, Washington County, I sit on the Public Safety Coordinating Council. That um, meets bi-monthly, uh, and membership includes the District Attorney of Washington County, the Presiding Judge, uh, the Sheriff, uh, the Head of Direction of Probation and Parole, Community Corrections, Juvenile Services, and several lay citizens and other stakeholders. I'm a two-time elected precinct committee person here in Washington County. Uh, I believe Washington County is an amazingly well-run county and that we're very fortunate to have had the county commission we've had. Uh, there's great services and the level of professionalism here in Washington County is unsurpassed. I've, I've interfaced with every county government uh, in, the, in the metro area, Columbia County, Clackamas County, Multnomah, and Washington, and I have to tell you, Washington County government stands out in my mind for its professionalism. Uh, one of the uh, areas that I think actually kind of illustrates that best is the way our county commission has dealt with the budget. I don't know if you know this, but uh, between the uh, 07, 08, and 09, 10 budget, uh, budgeting periods, the county reduced its full-time employees by 2% and it reduced its operating budget by 3%. That's responsible budgeting and planning for the future. Uh, if Tom Bryan at his State of the County speech was to be believed, there's a reserve of about 14 million also here that we have in Washington County. Uh, I will continue to emphasize that fiscal responsibility and work with the board to continue that tradition. Three biggest items in the county budget course of public safety and justice, land use, housing, and transportation, which is taken as one entity, and health and human services. My priorities serving in office, of course, first would be public safety and criminal justice. That's my bailiwick. That's what I know best. We have uh, a great sheriff's office here in Washington County, and we are very fortunate to be served by the sheriff and, it's in, and the uh, deputies that there. Their professionalism, once again, stands out. I've, I've dealt with every law enforcement agency, including I work in federal court, FBI and ATF and others, and I have to tell you, the Washington County Sheriff's Office is the best there is. Uh, I'm very, min very involved, uh, lifelong involvement professionally with uh, domestic violence issues and hopefully reducing the incident of domestic violence. I will make that a priority here in Washington County. We have a great unmet need for services for domestic violence victims here in Washington County. Uh, I was instrumental when I served as chair of Multnomah County Community Corrections in identifying a need, securing funding, and creating the West Women's Crisis Shelter. And I'm very proud of that work, and I was instrumental in that. See, I'm getting 30 seconds. Uh, other two, veteran services. Uh, I've had veterans as clients and also as friends. Um, the caseload at county veteran services is only increasing. I would look to foster collaboration, cooperation between that department, the sheriff's office, the criminal justice system, because we're finding many more of our returning veterans are finding their way into the criminal justice system. I would look at diversion programs for them, 
That's also being looked at at the state level. And then third and most important, neighborhood livability, which I think encompasses a lot of things. Um, clean, uh, clean air, clean water, infrastructure improvement, uh, reducing congestion, viable parks and recreation, healthy libraries. You get the idea. Um, I'll close with this. Please know that I will be engaged, responsive, and accountable as a county commissioner. I will foster collaboration and cooperation on the commission between governments and intergovernmental entities. I'll use facts, reason, my imagination, and the opinions of my constituents in making my decisions. Thank you, and I look forward to being your next county commissioner.